Hi guys, it's Angie with Rags, Tags, and Confections, and I thought I would welcome you to our home today. This is what you see when you walk into our home, and um, this is how we decorated for Easter this year. Um, pretty much everything out here we do have a video for already. There are a couple things we don't, so I will uh, try to remember which ones those are and uh, explain to you what we did. So this is the cross that we had done with the wireframe from CreatedHomeWithG.com and Gara's store. And this is this is our sunroom that. Um, we enter into and this is the place where Andrew and I like to just sit down and relax um, we have added a fountain in here and just have a few eggs in front of it and off to our left here we have our little seating area I'm going to try to back this up I've not used this camera yet to um, do any kind of movements with us. So I'm going to try to do this and not make y'all sick. So we have our seating area here and I like to sit out here and read during the day. As we come around our highest sense have now stopped blooming so they're getting ready to be planted outside here when the weather breaks. Now these apothecary jars here um, are ones we don't have a video for just yet but they were pretty simple to do Andrew just took some um, candlestick holders from the Dollar Tree and took a couple of old glass jars that we had here and I painted the lids for them I don't have a lid on the smaller one yet but um, I just painted the painted the lids here this is just a wooden lid and Andrew drilled a hole in the top of it for me and then these knobs are just um, clearance knobs from Hobby Lobby we just have a bunch of mismatched knobs that we um, use to put on top of there so I will get some stills of that for you okay then as we come around we have the rest of our seating and yes I do <laughs> I do love my plants out here this is the first home that we've been in. I've actually been able to keep them growing. It's an orchid that Andrew had gotten me for Valentine's Day. And down inside our crate here, you can see the little margarita garden that we had made together. Okay, and as we come past the orchid, there is one of the mixed media pieces hiding back there. And the little faux stone wall candle or succulent holder that we made yesterday okay so now as we come up we have our second door that we can come in from oh let me move the snow shovel here guys unfortunately we do still we are still getting rid of snow here And I just have some Easter eggs tucked in amongst all of our plants. Around here we have a centerpiece that I had put together. Um, with uh, green or not greenery flowers from Hobby Lobby and from the dollar store down below here I've not done a video on this little guy but it's just a paper mache bunny that I have decoupaged with a piece of napkin and wrapped a little pink bow around it the crates that I have setting up are crates my father had made and um, they go to our craft fair shows with us for sale but since we're in between craft fairs right now, I'm kind of using them as um, height for out here for objects. Again, some more little eggs in our plants. And this is a little tree that um, we also have a video on. 
Now in this one I have added, just set some little bunnies here from the Dollar Tree just to add something more to it. And the carrots we also have a video on, the raffia, or the twine wrapped carrots. And just some more eggs. I like to tuck the eggs in just here and there. Okay, there are the faux hydrangeas that we had made in my old galvanized water pitcher. And they're sitting there on the windowsill. And some more of our, um, yeah, flowers have <laughs> uh, withered away and they're due to be trimmed and transplanted outside. <clears throat> These are the little wreaths. They're not quite in the window where we had wanted them, but um, they're up nonetheless. But they're just pe little wreaths that we had made out of some leftover wire and um, pieces from the cross that we had left it. And yes, off here to the side is our card rack for when anybody wants to stop by the shop here at the house and do some shopping. So there's that part, guys. I will get some stills here for you, and then I will take you into our dining room for which we are getting ready for our Easter dinner this evening with our children. So I will bring you right back, guys.